There are many different ways to prepare fish. And what I'm gonna show you today is really, really good for great firm fleshed oily fish like this wonderful Geraldton Kingfish that I've got here. What we're going to do is we're gonna cure this a little bit like Gravlax with some sugar, salt, gin, some dill, grapefruit, star anise, and coriander seed. So to start with, we have a little container. This is a 24 hour process, guys, okay? In here, I have my curing mix. Now, a curing mix is an equal part salt-sugar ratio. So I've got light brown sugar, salt, and then I've got my spices in here as well, okay? So I've got my coriander seed and my star anise. To this, I'm going to add some dill. It doesn't need to be chopped finely, guys, okay? It's just to impart flavour because when we go to serve it, we're going to wipe it all off. That's going to go inside there. And then we've got this beautiful Harvey grapefruit. We're just going to take a little bit of that zest off. These natural essential oils in the zest are really going to liven this up and they're going to go fantastic with that botanicals gin. Now our secret ingredient is some of this Giniversity botanicals gin. A little bit of that, probably about 15 mils, okay? Give it a mix around. Now you want an even layer down on the bottom. We're going to put our fish in and then we're going to put the rest of that on top, just like this. We're going to pop that in the fridge overnight and what's going to happen is that sugar and salt is going to draw all of the moisture out of the fish and you're going to have a beautiful piece of cured fish. We're going to serve this today with a lovely little salsa. We have our shallots, our chilli and our cucumber and then half an avocado. Okay, now a little trick is just scoop your avocado out with a spoon, just like that. A nice little dice of our avocado inside and a nice little mix around. This is a beautiful refreshing salsa and it's gonna go wonderful with those gin flavors. Now to our fish. Here's one that I did yesterday that we're gonna cut up now. And we're just gonna take off any of that residual salt and sugar and spices because that's gonna be quite strong. And now we're just gonna slice this nice and thin. And then we're just gonna take some pieces of kingfish and fold them up on themselves. So you're creating a little bit of height. Now all of these fantastic aromas of fennel and aniseed and dill and gin are gonna go absolutely wonderful with this little salsa we've got here. And then we're just gonna dress it with our yuzu and lime. That citrus from the yuzu is gonna be absolutely fantastic with this fish.